Clifford Goes to Hollywood by Norman Birdwell. This is my dog Clifford. We do a lot of things together. We swim together. We play ball together. In winter, we go sliding together. One day, a man stopped us and asked if Clifford would like to be in the movie. Clifford had to be taking a screen test. The man told him to act happy. Clifford acted happy. Then he asked him to act angry. Then Clifford pretended to be in love. Then the man told him to act frightened. He did. Clifford acted sad. The man said Clifford was a terrific actor. He wanted him to be in the movie. The next day, they took Clifford to Hollywood. We hated to see him go. When the movie was finished, everybody said Clifford was the best actor in the world. Clifford was a star. In Hollywood, they built him a big doghouse. The kind of movie stars you have. They gave him fancy dishes and brought him special things to eat. Clever star colors are made of gold and especially fur. So were covered with diamonds. He even has a swimming pool shape like a bone. Clever while being a star, they put his footprint in the cement on Hollywood Boulevard, just like the other stars. Everybody, everywhere he went, he was surrounded by mobs of movie fans. They all wanted souvenirs. His fans were everywhere. There were water parties. Clever got tired of them. But they said movie stars had to go to water parties. I saw Clever on a television talk show. I thought he looked a little sad. One day, he looked over his wall and saw a girl play with her dog. He missed me. Cliff was tired of being a star. That night, he jumped over the wall. He wet all the fancy dishes and colors and parties behind. Clifford came home, and he's home to stay. He'd rather be with me than in Hollywood. I'm glad he loves me as much as I love him. The end. If you like this video, please subscribe.